Managing containers in Digi Remote Manager. Digi Remote Manager enables deployment of custom applications via containers. In this video, we'll review how to upload your container and how to edit the settings of the container within Digi Remote Manager. In order to deploy a container with a custom application on a Digi device, you first need to start by going to the device dashboard. Navigate to Status and Containers, and here you see we do not have a container uploaded. So we'll go to Upload a new container, select the container, and click Apply. This will upload that container. Once we have uploaded that container, we'll want to make some configurations to that container. Clicking on the wrench within the container, we can enable it, clone the Dell operating system, add a virtual network, have it start on boot, and give it optional parameters, including access to specific directories and access to the onboard serial port. Now we have the container uploaded and scheduled to start on boot. So let's go ahead and click apply so that we can view the status of that container. So within Digi Remote Manager, go to Containers. And test LXC. And you see the same settings we just created on the device interface. And because we set the container to start on reboot, the simplest way to start the container is to reboot the device. So I'll go to the Systems tab on the device page and click Reboot which will take a few minutes, but when it completes its reboot, the container will be running. So now we can log back into the device and go to Status and Containers, and there you go. Our container is running.